Welcome to the future of human-computer interactions, introducing character AI, where imagination meets artificial intelligence and the boundaries of creatives are redefined. Now with character AI, you hold the power to create like life characters, each with their own unique personalities and traits, ready to engage in the open ended conversation and collaboration. Now throughout today's video, I'm going to showcase this amazing application so you can get a better idea of what character AI is, how you can actually use it and what you can actually do with it. So with that thought, let's get right into the video. Hey, what is up guys? Welcome back to another YouTube video at the world of AI. In today's video, we're going to take a look at character.ai, which is an amazing new application that is basically your own AI assistant. Now, this is a groundbreaking initiative that aims to realize the long awaited science fiction vision of engaging in open ended conversations, as well as collaborations with AI in general, as well as robots. Now, this project enable individuals to build their own lifelike characters, thus breathing life into to their own dreams and ideas it's basically a real person that's artificial intelligence and it can interact and help you do many different things whether it's being your own virtual assistant helping you complete certain tasks that you might require help within as well as doing some of the menial tasks like you would see with auto gbt and many of these other autonomous ai agents now this ambitious mission invites people from all walks of life to participate and become creators themselves to interact with this website now, at the heart of this project lies a set of powerful creation tools that empower users to design and craft unique characters with personalities and traits. Now, these characters are showcased on the project's homepage, which you can see over here. You have different pro like different types of AI assistants with different names that could be used for different cases. So in this case, you have Pair Programmer, which can be used to help you with programming needs. In this case, you have Lily, who can help you with your friendly as a friendly AI assistant with basic menial tasks. You can just chat or have a basic AI friend if you want. Now, this is the array of diverse characters that are presented over here, and it's basically showcasing the capacity to foster creativity and imagination with this amazing application. And this is something that we're going to showcase throughout today's video as we go deeper into showcasing some of the cool things you can do, have things such as having certain types of image generation with these AI characters. You can have game characters, anime, movie theaters, uh, TV and TV, sorry. You can chat with these certain types of characters and AI assistants to help you discover many different things with this AI character application. And this is something that we'll check out in today's video as we go forward. But before we actually do that, guys, it would mean the whole world to me if you guys can go on Twitter, give this a follow if you guys haven't already. I'm going to be posting a lot of channel updates as well as AI news updates over here. So definitely stay tuned with the Twitter page. Now guys, if you guys want to become a Patreon, please do so as you will get access to a lot of cool things as in get access to our Discord, which will be providing a lot of benefits in later on and as we grow with this channel. We're also going to post a lot of news as well as showcase a lot of engaging things within the actual Discord. So if you're interested, definitely become a Patreon so you can get access to this exclusive private Discord. Now, if you guys haven't subscribed, it would mean the whole world to me if you guys can do so. Turn on the notification bell, like this video, and if you guys haven't seen my previous videos, I highly recommend that you do so because there's a lot of content and a lot of value that you will definitely benefit from. So with that thought, guys, let's get right into the video. Now, guys, this character AI project provides support for two distinct creator experiences, catering to individuals with varying levels of expertise and creative preferences. And firstly, it is known as the first mode, which is the quick mode. And this is basically a user friendly and efficient approach for creators to build capitating, ca captivating, sorry, not captivating, <laughs> captivating characters in less than a minute. The streamlined process basically enables users to dive right into the character creation journey without any extensive learning curve. And obviously there's the second one, which is the more complex one. And this is where the project offers an advanced mode. And this mode equips creators with a set of powerful tools that allows for fine tuning and perfecting their characters to greater degree of detail. Now guys, to aid creators in their own endeavors, the project includes a comprehensive reference sheet. And this basically has 
outlines of all character attributes that can be modified and customized so it serves as a valuable resource in helping creators to understand the various aspects to alter and shape their characters personalities appearance or even behavior now this project encourages new users to begin their creative journey by like crafting a quick character first so you can get a better understanding of how the actual website works and operates and from this you can obviously move on forward with advanced character module which can help you create more detailed and more of like a different type of personality of the character that could be tweaked around for your own preference and this is something that could be even outsourced to other people to help them as a virtual assistant so this is one thing that i'll showcase later on in the video now one thing i want to talk about is how to use the quick creation it's fairly easy there's a fairly easy demo for this you put input a name you input the greeting as to what they would introduce themselves as for example you have albert einstein could say hello i'm albert einstein i was born in march 14 1879 and he obviously talks about how he created relativity uh, special relativity and general relativity like how he created theory now in terms of visibility you can have it private unlisted or public and you can have your own avatar for it and this is just showcasing some of the ways to set up a quick character with their own attributes now if you were to go to the advanced creation you have a huge like description as well as a huge like step-by-step -step process of how you can do so and this is something that i'll leave in the description below because this could be very useful for a lot of people in creating their own ai assistant now you can set up the scene have negative guidance you can have unusual patterns to how do you fix them and these are some of the tutorials that could be used to help you improve it so if you want to get more of a better understanding of how you can use the advanced creation definitely check this out in the character ai docs so with that thought let's get into the next step of the video where we'll showcase what you can actually do with character ai and some of the demos to showcase how you can actually utilize these different attributes in creation so guys, this current site is in beta, so you might want to keep that in mind. But first things first, you need to create your own account. It's free to create. I created it with my Google account. Uh, I think it was pretty safe to do so. So there's nothing, no harm in terms of creating your account. Just read the policies and make sure you don't connect any other third party application to your Google account without knowing what is happening. So I just use the temporary account to do so. Uh, there's also a paid plan i'm not too sure if that is any beneficial because you can utilize many of the free things right now and it could be used for a lot of different things so just keep that in mind you have a book which references the documents that i was showcasing before and you can also search and change the language to whatever you want over here now there's a home section which is going to showcase the things that are featured over here you have a feed that is showcasing some of the cool things that people have done and created now they, there's some cool things people are having fun with in terms of having fun creating different types of characters that could be used for a lot of different use cases here you have your create button you can create your own character or create your own room and you can which in which you can have different people chat with your own room and in this case you can create your own character that could be used to chat with and now you can have different chats over here you have a community that in which you can report check out the announcements service status as well as sharing your own character and this is where you're going to have all your chats and rooms set up over here now let's actually take a look at our own character assistant that we can use and chat with so over here it, it states remember everything character says is made up so that's one good thing you want to keep in mind now over here the character assistant it says hello i'm an ai assistant trained by character.ai i can help answer questions brainstorm ideas draft email write code give advice and much more so let us actually just say write me a formulated formulated response to how gravity works now i'm just asking it random things to see how useful and how correct it could be now gravity is one of the four foundational forces of nature now you can see one thing it's a little slow compared to many of these other generative ai apps but it's okay and over here you can see it generates a summary of how gravity works if we click on the bar or this uh, arrow key now 
you can also i believe copy the clipboard and export it somewhere else so this is very good and in terms of adding different things you can ask it to create an image or upload an image so in this case i'm going to ask it to create an image of gravity so let's see how it's able to do this and it might take a couple seconds but once it's done i'll be right back and just like that we got this sort of image now i'm going to attach it and i'm going to ask it what describe this image now this looks very weird and it does a really good job with his encoders to describe what the actual image is which is quite surprising now let's actually take a look at another ai assistant now you can see that there is no nonsense ai assistant so this is kind of cool this is a friendly ai assistant and in certain cases it doesn't have to be something that could be used for helping you in certain tasks you can use it for like entertainment purposes in which you can ask it certain things have fun with it play games with it which is really cool uh, i've never interacted with this so i'm gonna find something cool and i'll be right back all right, looks like there's a game right here. Let's play a text-based adventure game, I'll be your guide. You are taught upside down in a sticky web of slick three feet off the ground. After looking around, trying to think of a way out of this predicament, you notice that your trusty boot, boot knife has fallen to the ground. If you stretch your arm far enough, you might be able to pick it up free for yourself. An old knife, old boot knife lies on the ground, just within reach. I pick it up. So I believe this is like a text adventure game where you interact with the actual AI to formulate an RPG type of game. So in certain ways you interact and it responds a certain way. And now what will you do next? It keeps asking and you formulate different things to response in this game. Now obviously this is not like some crazy game. It's just like a cool riddle or like small little textual game that you can talk and play around with. So if maybe if you had a Game of Thrones or something like your famous favorite series, you can chat around with it and have fun as you can formulate different timelines of different games. Now one cool thing is you can have a different type of world image generation in which you can generate certain types of things uh, this is something that's very weird, but you gotta be careful. In this case, you have a world RPG, and you can basically help it formulate certain things. And this is really cool, have, it have different types of image generation. You can talk with famous people that you really love. So say for example, if you love Elon Musk, Kanye West, or many of these other different types of celebrities, you can chat with them. And that's really cool as you can have a lot of fun playing and interacting with people. You can have fun time interacting with game characters, anime characters, movie and TV characters, which is really cool. Uh, you have language learning, which will help you tutor you to learn a certain type of language, which is amazing. You have different discussions with different like AI assistants. And maybe you can even talk about religion with many of these different types of AI assistants. Now, there's a lot of things you can do, and it just keeps on going as the community keeps working on creating their own AI assistant to help you do so. Now, one cool thing is, I believe with the plate pen, you can implement your own AI assistant into your own workflow. And this is something that I believe that you can do as you play around with this. Now, I'm lastly gonna just showcase one cool demo of something that I've done with a character. And once that is done, I'll be right back and I'll showcase it to you guys. Now guys, I basically started talking with the pair programmer in which I asked it to write, create a code for accounting firm website from page only. And it states that it is not able to add any functionality or design obviously, because this is just a basic like template as to what she, the actual AI was able to create. Now in this case, I asked it write a Python program to handle the zero division error. And in this case, it's working in this example to create and solve this error, which is really awesome. So this is really, really, really cool as to what this application is doing as it's fairly free and you have access to many of these characters to help you do a lot of cool things, a lot of fun things, and a lot of things that will definitely help you and implement into your own workflow. So I hope you found this video to be very beneficial guys and you got some sort of value out of character.ai. 
and thank you guys just so much for watching i really really appreciate it definitely join the patreon if you're interested and join the private discord as well as many cool features in the future definitely give world of ai on twitter a follow if you guys haven't and for the youtube definitely give this a subscribe turn on notification bell like this video and definitely check out my previous videos as there's a lot of content and a lot of value value that you'll definitely benefit from so with that thought guys thank you guys so much for watching have an amazing day and i'll see you guys very shortly peace out fellas